Hi friends. Okay, let's see here. I am just going to discuss you about the difference between the profiles and permission sets. What exactly profile means? Profile is a thing which restricts the user on object access. In the process, in the object access in the sense cut operations. Okay, where we just created some more profiles where tabs and object settings and moreover. I just made some object to be a default <coughs> inactive for a certain user. In a later days, I just thought to activate the again. Instead of updating the whole profile, I can do the same thing. I can assign, I can create a new permission set and assign to a particular user. That means what it is doing, it is exactly doing what profile is doing. But the difference is, we don't want to update the whole records which so far we created in the profiles. We just assign the permission set. It gives extra support for an object for a user to access a card operation. Let's see. Here we are seeing the student DB is a default on. What I will do here in my profile settings, I will make this thing to be a default off. Where ILD is my profile, what I will do here, let's have a glance. Okay. Okay. Let's see here. We will get object settings. In this object settings, what I will do here, I am going to select a student DB. That means we are just discussing about a student DB. The whole, whole section is going on school DB. Here I am going to select a default off for a school DB. Okay, it bit slow in my networks today. Okay, I don't know why it is happening. Just see here school DB. Just click on school DB. It will relate to school DB settings. Just click on edit, edit, here I provided all the card operation for an user, I can start just to make the difference between permissions and profiles, nothing else. Where I am just selecting here default off, save, it just saved up, what I will do here, this is my user. Where I'm here we will see school DB. If I refresh, the school DB will be gone, will be off. School DB off, right? It exists in the tab menu. The thing, the customized tabs we can able to add that thing to be a tab menu. Here we are seeing default school DB. What I will do here again in tab settings. This is not happening in the profile settings. I am not switched to permission still now. I will switch in a few minutes. Okay. And just select a tab hidden here and save up the thing. And just go and refresh the page of user. Okay. This is my second page in my private browser. I just open the two users simultaneously for a demonstration purpose. Now we are seeing school debut after some time it will be disappeared because we just made the tab settings to be default off. Still it existing because it is on the browser slow. Now you will see here. You won't be able to find the school DB here. See, no school DB because I just made to be profile settings to be default of tab hidden. What I will do here, permission sets. 
now we will see just the permission sins will give extra access for an user extra access for an user is the operations are same as profiles but if you change profiles the all users must be changed to a certain profiles so for permission sins which can be able to create some access to a particular user so for consider there is a team member which is promoted to a team leader at the time you just want to access the, all the profiles so far you created see i have one permission sets already created i will just create it for time say is what what i will do here object settings i will go for object settings See here, object settings. See here. Okay, for time's sake, I just created a permission that is good. How I think because net become very slow. <laughs> just select the school DB here. and here and just made available for school db in by default it is in off state that means it won't select anything just select here we will get two options visible and available okay visible in the sense it makes see here if we select visible available Select available. Visible in the sense it will be appear available. If we select available, what happens? Click on manage users. I just click on manage users. Okay. Just wait a while. It takes too long of time. I'll click manage assignments. And no records will display. We have to add assignment. That means which type of particular users we have to assign. That means just click on add assignments. where you navigate to a page called users page that means users menu there you can select the number of users that means which type of user you have to provide this type of permission says to access the school db and moreover i have school records Select on this is my user Imdadullah and then click on assign. Now it will ask OK. That means done. If you click done, okay, completed right. Once go here, you won't find school DB here. Just click refresh. Just click on refresh. You will find a school DB here now. Sorry for the lay. It's take too much time because I think today's network traffic is high in my area. Okay, school DB. This is how we can make permission says more benefit for a user without changing the existing profiles. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe.